Hi there, um, just so you know, um, I've decided to do a little video again. Well, there's a surprise. Um, this time it's everyone keeps saying, I hear people saying, um, well, you know, there's not much software on AROS, um, but guess what? That's complete rubbish. Right, uh, just to prove the point, oh, that's not that nicely, um, I, I'm going to back off a little bit off the uh, 68K software. Um, you've probably noticed in the past I've done some stuff with Jane, Janus, etc., but um, I'm, I'm not going to be doing that much more now. Um, we still use it, obviously Janus is still being developed, but um, I think we've got, for, for me personally, um, we've got all the software I think I need. Oh, not all, I mean, he's always want more, but um, it's got the bulk of the stuff I want, so I'm just going to go through it and um, give you some examples of um, the world of AROS. Um, okay, so uh, here we go. Right, first thing, internet. Now, obviously we've got, um, uh, we've got OWB. Okay, so let's put OWB down here and you can see and we'll open up, but this is quite a good one, BBC page, do like this. Okay, right, uh, let's put that back to there. Now, let's go into a Sabre. Okay, this is an MSN client. <laughs> okay, then of course we've got um, Wookie Chat. So there's also Jabberwocky, which I haven't got set up. Okay, something I do quite a lot is uh, controlling servers um, for what I do for my work, web, web development. So we've got a remote desktop client, so let me open up my. Um, See if we find it. Here we go. That's now logging into my web server. Um, this is my SQL with my SQL Server on it. So I'm now running a Windows uh, 2003 client. You can see it's my SQL Server Studio. So yeah, we got that covered. Um, let's uh, let's shut that down. Log off. Yes, too right. So I can remote desktop into most Windows servers there. Let's exit that. So that's basic internet applications. Uh, I don't think I did show earlier was um, I showed network, but I didn't show the uh, Skype. So I'm going to have to cut and paste this in. Um, yeah, so it's, it's a bit of a cheat. We haven't got a Skype client, but this is just really an idea of way way to use this. It's a, a site called IMO.IM, and they have a, a Skype tool here. So um, let me just log in. Okay, so we just sign on this. Now this has Skype, everything basically, loads and loads. Is anyone online? Um, here we go, there's a few people online. So you've got Skype. Um, it's actually very good, I must admit. Um, it gives you a little panel and you can just type messages into there. Um, so that's Skype. Let me just close that. Right. Um, so let's go. Oh, uh, before I go into the, to leave internet applications altogether. Um, Let's uh, now just run this little thing called YT Mon, and I'm going to switch into. Let me close down Wookie Chat, and I'm going to load up YouTube. YouTube.com. Now oh, that's got me signed in. Right, my videos. <clears throat> okay, now all we have to do is we find the link, and then we copy it to the clipboard that automatically then decides where it's got to go and as you can see now it's popping up the player Hi guys, uh, just a quick message there you uh, go youtube video you know, uh, uh, this is a video about yeah, hd audio yeah. drivers let's get rid of that right so pretty much got um the internet covered i think um there's loads of tools obviously in the uh, on the command line as well um wget Oh god, loads of things. I don't want to go into them now. Right, so that's the internet. Okay, let's have some games. Um, well, I mostly know I'm rubbish at games. I'm not really into games, but 
here we go uh, this is one I actually do like and I actually do play this so okay games so now but that's 3d yeah look at that it's 3d games this is using the now this machine's my Nvidia powered machine which is a 7800 powered um, pretty awesome machine I must admit um, but let's find another game on here that I like uh, not everything is uh, has to be 3d but that we can do very very good 3d and I like this now this is actually accelerated uh, with OpenGL I actually like this because it reminds me of Arkanoid in the old days um, which is one of the few games I played uh, what's it doing now it's dropping now oh, sod it okay let's quit that so you can see full screen games um, uh, let's just see if I've got another one, one more game just to show you that. Uh, excuse me, I mean, there's loads of games, I and mean, one thing a AWOS is getting a lot of is an awful lot of games. Well, let's have something yeah, like, like, like chess, there you go, a chess game. So, all kinds of different games we have here. So, that's games. Okay, so let's have some farm maintenance. Well, farm maintenance, I mean, here are. What, what more do you want to know? We've got directory opus. Um, I use it for just about everything. Um, there we go. So it's absolutely fantastic. And if you link it up, yeah, see that uh, even that. See, did, did you notice that, right? I'm not going to hide that. I'm going to keep that. Something just something crashed. It's just, we just suspended it, right? There we go. So let's carry on now. Uh, in fact, actually, what happened was something's locked up. So I'm going to get rid of that. So I can do left Amiga escape, bring up Scout. And I want to get rid of that window, so I can click on this. I'm going to get rid of that output. I'm going to close it. That window's now gone, nice and clean. There you go. Let's how about that for cleaning up? Right. So I was going to show you some an animation. This is um, something I did for um, the show. Uh, this is the J minor. This is the Ham 8 version I did. Um, so that's pretty good. Now, so we've got five ways. Obviously, you've got. Um, uh, Wanderer, uh, but we've also got this nice little tool here called Low View. So if you want to just have a quick flick through some images, um, we can just quickly flick around our images. This is a lovely little player that is. I think it's based on um, Hollywood. Uh, so that's quite nice, that is. Right, so graphics. Uh, well, you saw Low View for viewing graphics, but we've got th um, three or four packages. Now, I, there's Lunar Paint. Um, which I'm not going to show you, um, which is the original one, but we've got Graphex, which is really nice. Uh, this is a registered, um, like a 256 color paint package. Welcome, load, there you go. So, uh, this is a nice little registered based paint program. Um, I'm not going to go into great details, but that's um, Graphex. We've also got Amifig, which is this really nice um, structure drawing program. Uh, which is very good and uh, Manu's been doing some great stuff with this as you can see the angry uh, angry computer so we can s zoom in nicely this is a, a really really powerful program um, but it's structured drawing as opposed to bitmap so let's close that and load paint now load paint is probably my, f my favorite I have to be honest let's get rid of that over there um, we can let me just go in and show you something of this. It's, a, it's an OpenGL paint program which means if you don't have OpenGL version um, the Nvidia card you can't get the best out of this unless you've got a really really fast machine so here you can see we can scroll in okay it's got this lovely little grid pattern let me just zoom out a bit so you can see it um, this really nice toolkit um, if I open up another let's, in fact, let's make this full screen and let's open up another image, uh, graphics, Amiga logo, yep, let's cut, let's cut, and I'll tell you what we'll do is we'll flood fill the background, and then I will cut that, sorry this is going to be rubbish, um, but I just want to show you, so we'll take that, and then I want to, let's paste that onto there, see? So now we can move that around. Um, I'm, I'm not I'm multi. It, 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 trust me, it's a really good paint program. So there's three really good paint programs there, um, which to to me, uh, I think pretty much give what most. No, not all. You know, I'm not, not saying this is going to be for everyone, but it's um, for for the average user. I think they're pretty pretty damn good. Um, so that's um, graphics.